Cinderella. Cinderella lives with her stepmother and two bad and ugly stepsisters. She has to work all day while her sisters do nothing but play and try on new dresses and shoes. There is a ball at the prince's palace tonight, and Cinderella's sisters are ready to go to it. Cinderella is very sad. She is not allowed to go to the ball. Suddenly, a fairy godmother comes to the house. Do not worry, Cinderella, she says. She waves her magic wand. In a moment, a very beautiful dress appears, and there is a coach with two horses ready to take her to the ball. But remember, says the fairy godmother, you must come back before midnight. Cinderella is in the palace. There are many nice-looking young ladies, but she is the prettiest of all. The prince dances with Cinderella all the time, but nobody knows the name of the beauty. When the clock strikes twelve, Cinderella runs away without saying goodbye. She leaves a beautiful little slipper on the stairs in a hurry. The prince and his men travel through the kingdom looking for the beautiful lady from the ball. They come to Cinderella's house. Cinderella's sisters are ready to try on the little slipper, but their feet are too big. The stepmother is furious. Then Cinderella puts on the slipper. It is just right. Now I know, the prince says. You are my beautiful dancer. I want you to be my wife. There was a big wedding party at the palace. Cinderella and Prince were very happy. They had so many guests. There were the king, the queen, and the fairy godmother. They all danced and had a lot of fun. The prince and Cinderella lived long and happily ever after.